So who is this person and what will they be doing, Mark? Yeah, Emily, thank you for having me. Apple hired Ulrich Kranz, and this is actually a big name in the automotive industry. He worked at BMW for about 30 years, ultimately becoming in charge of their electric car division, which produced the, the i3, that boxy-looking uh, four-door uh, BMW that's uh, a hybrid, as well as the i8, the uh, over $100,000 uh, electric car slash hybrid uh, from BMW. Neither of those uh, BMW models have become smash hits. The, the design of the i3 was criticized. The i8, for all intents and purposes, is not a very good car, uh, but they are well designed, and those are cars that probably uh, have inspired Apple to go into the field. And more recently, he was the co-founder and CEO of a self-driving electric car a company called Canoe, and he also spent a few months as the CTO of Faraday Future. What is Apple's relationship with BMW? I wonder uh, if there's a backstory here. Yeah, Apple has a good relationship with uh, BMW. BMW was actually Apple's first partner uh, 17 years ago on iPod, if you remember those, integration in cars. They were also Apple's first partner on car key. It's the feature they launched last year that allows your iPhone through the wallet app to double as a, as a digital car key for some newer BMW models. Uh, there's also a picture that floated around Twitter back in 2014 of Tim Cook actually testing out the BMW i8 in front of Apple's Cupertino headquarters. And there's also been meetings here and there between uh, Apple executives and BMW executives over in, in Europe. Now, you last reported that Apple had lost some significant folks in the car department. You know, where does that leave the, that department now? How far along is Apple, really, in developing a car? Yeah, I don't think anything has changed. Apple's still in the very early exploratory stages. Uh, this car is probably five years away at the very minimum, and that might be a lowball estimate. Uh, to be honest with you, so I would say five to seven or eight years is what we had reported back in January. Uh, the car team has many former Tesla executives, including uh, former Tesla vice presidents in charge of key car components like Tesla's autopilot self-driving software. They hired Steve McManus two years ago, who was in charge of car interiors and exterior design at Tesla, and he has a massive team of people working on car hardware. Uh, they also hired the former head of manufacturing engineering and drivetrain systems from Tesla as well. And Doug Field, the person who runs the project, was the chief engineer uh, at Tesla and oversaw the development of the Model 3. So you can't really get much more evidence than that, that uh, Apple is looking to build a, a Tesla rival down the road.